all right guys this is some nifty and daily chart uh, right now nifty exactly near resistance line so see here this is the resistance line and this is the resistance zone right this is resistance zone price not able to break this zone and here today price open a gap up and after that price drop uh, to the level of yesterday opening and closing so yesterday opening and closing almost the same and we expecting the price may give a correction near moving average 20 all right right now moving average somewhere at uh, 20 somewhere here and we are expecting that price may give a correction and at that time moving average will be somewhere there and here uh, right now it's forming as a support all right so i'm looking for a pullback uh, if you not see overall uh, market trend it is a bullish and we are expecting the price may give a correction uh, from that area now question is that can i go for short here no, i'm not interested to take any position a sell direction we never know if price break this level so definitely i'll go for buy so let's see today's uh, top gainer stock our uh, first one britannia okay let's see Britannia. Okay, so after a long uh, rally here, you can see this is a long rally from this level, and the price drop to this level around three thousand three hundred somewhere there. So right now, price exactly near supporting line. So here you can see this one support support and today price just given a correction and we are expecting that price may give a correction to the level of uh, around 3500 because this is a strong resistance uh, there are 200 exponential moving average and today uh, here they form a bullish candle and if you now see uh, RSI divergence here and uh, we expecting that price may give a correction from this area all right so let's see in a small time frame how it should look like mm, let's go to one hour chart okay one hour chart uh, okay it's not loading properly one hour chart mm, price still below this moving average so we need a breakout all right so once price break this level around three, four, five, uh, five, so definitely we will go for uh, buy. Now let's see another stock. Another Asian pain and Titan company. Let's see Asian pain. Asian pain. Okay. So everybody knows I have a big investment in Asian pain. So that, uh, and right now, uh, price created all time high today. And that was a raised 10 line. Yeah. Uh, they form many doji pattern below this raised 10 line. But finally price broke this raised 10 line. All right, yeah. Now question is that can I go for buy? No. Uh, we need a pullback near the supporting line. Now it's becoming a support. First, that was a resistance. Now it's becoming a support. So we need a pullback. So next stock uh, that was Asian pain Titan Company, I think. Yeah, Titan. Titan. Okay. Titan, yeah. Titan are exactly near uh, raised end line, but I am not interested to take any position below this raised end line here. So I can see here, this is a strong resistance. This is a strong resistance, and this is the resistance zone. It's a, uh, like a shadow. 
so we can say like a zone all right so i'm looking for y after breaking this raised then and so on but uh, in between this area i'm not interested to take any position let's see another one let's see js w steel last one uh, where was here somewhere there okay write down says w yeah i think it will be available like that yeah what happened oh it's not a jsw steel uh, all right this one jsw steel a uh, clear uptrend and now it's uh, taking a support near moving average to uh, near moving average 20 and after that we have seen this the bullish candlestick pattern so we are looking for buy after breaking this uh, uh, higher point all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching